Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy, Nenrik, and today I'll be doing a video discussing Gon's brother. Now, when it comes to Hunter x Hunter, we basically know that Gon, he is the main character, and there is also a lot of other freaks that we don't know about. I know some people, they're basically saying stuff like, whoa, they see the title, and they're thinking, what is this guy talking about? But this is going to be a theory that I've had that I've been thinking of for a while, and I just got to say that a lot of people, they might get thrown off, but I just want to discuss this. Now, for starters, we know that Jing, he basically dropped Gon off back on Whale Island, back to Mito, and he basically disappeared. Like, he gave him up, he was like, yo, take my child, and he basically went off and did his own thing. Now, the one thing that I do gotta say is that from that period of time, there could have been, like, Jing, he could have been doing anything. Like, he could have been doing anything, and it's not too far-fetched to say that he maybe might have had another affair with a woman because we don't know anything about Gon's mom, and from what it seems like with Jing, it doesn't seem like that they were, like, love. Like, it doesn't seem like that they were, like, living together, so it doesn't seem like that they were, like, wives or anything. So, technically, Jing, he could still be running around and doing anything that he wanted to. I'm just saying, but... I definitely do think that if there is a there is a possibility that Jing could have had another relationship with another woman and that could also mean that they gone he could have a half brother somewhere lurking around I think that'll be dope and I think it'll be cool if we did get introduced to that now this part of the video I'm not gonna lie and it's gonna be a little bit spoiler heavy but the thing about it is even though this is gonna be the most spoiler part this is gonna be the most important part of the video so if you're an anime only I uh, you kind of in a pick. I'm not gonna lie because this point's about to make like the most sense, but I don't want to spoil you. So click off the video if you guys don't want to be spoiled. But if you guys want to hear what I have to say, then I'm just gonna go ahead and say it now. In the manga, we've been introduced to Dawn Freaks. Yes, we've been introduced to Dawn Freaks, and basically we know that this has to be some type of ancestor to the Freaks. We know he has to be some type. He has to be related to them some type of way, but. The one thing that I do I'd say is that this is more proof that there could be another Freaks members out there or more Freaks member out there, possibly even a Freaks clan because late this late in the series, we got introduced to a new member of the Freaks family and Don Freaks, I'm pretty sure that he isn't one who's, he's not the one who's going to be Don's brother because he's like 300 years old, but Jing is still like, I, I'm sure he's not Don's brother. However, this is more evidence for me to believe that Jing, yeah, it's not too far-fetched to think that he could have had another child or maybe Jing even brought his child to the dark continent and gave him to go hang out with Don Freaks that's just another theory that I gotta have now I know some people they also say that uh Phaeton he could be related to Gon because we know the whole resemblance between him short black hair and all this other stuff that he was born in Meteor City I'm not a big fan of that theory but I can't see what people mean by that but overall what are you guys thoughts on the opinion or the theory of Gon having another brother I think it would be dope comment you guys see down below subscribe if you haven't peace out